front of the camera and not beside the camera. Well, the guy that doesn't want to be in front of the camera then just leaves the camera running even though you tell him to do this. That's what happens. So you can That's say, okay, just you can it. go like that. That's okay, just You can go, and because we got a monitor on, we can see that, he, oh, okay, now we can start. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is old cam. And this is not a spring chicken. Today we're going to be talking about... The, uh, a, a fascinating piece of the internet that people really don't think of, which is called lack of migration. And people go, what <laughs> migration? Because, you know, a lot, of, a lot of the information you hear about social networking, branding, and all of that is um, developing a presence, right? Yeah. And, you know, they talk about it like it's the same, well, let's, let's just say you build a fan base on Facebook, or you build it on Twitter, or you build it on MySpace, or on YouTube, or on Funny or Die. But one of the things that we're discovering, because because we've been doing this for a while, is, are you ready for this, the lack of migration. Well, absolutely. We can guarantee you that when we're talking about, when she was doing a thing as the bikinis are a little while ago, which basically we have a tendency to wander because it's in between the pieces is when she does it. We were talking about the fact that in another life form, she was getting, uh, when she was actually a model, she mm -hmm. was drawing a million hits a day and 14 million downloads a month mm -hmm. to that website. And she's the very same person today as she was then, but the people that watched the website uh, and were members of the fan club didn't migrate. Mm -hmm. And we, we can, we're, you know, we say the same thing. We had um, uh, 10, 11,000 followers on uh, MSN Soapbox. Right. We let people know for months that it was closing down and that we had another site over on, um, on this channel, which is YouTube, which they kind of <laughs> haven't taken us down yet. <laughs> you know, but, um, that we were migrating over. We got basically <laughs> zero that migrated over. Zero. Well, there were probably some. No. But part no, of it, no, you don't think so? Nope. Nobody. Nobody. No, no one. And, you're, and a lot of you would argue the point that, well, then they really weren't your fans to start with if they didn't migrate. Well, uh, so. uh, uh. We know people in the business that will not, they're in the business, they will not go to Twitter, they will not go to Facebook, they will not use social media under any circumstances, mm -hmm. they won't do it. Mm -hmm. And uh, they will not go to YouTube, if their life depended upon it, they wouldn't go to YouTube. But they did, they did MSN, but they would not move off of MSN. They basically, they had uh, blogs on MSN. When those went down, they didn't blog anywhere else. Interesting. Yeah, so there is a, there's a problem with migration between one social platform and another social platform. If you uh, if you if you're on Facebook, if you're on uh, Facebook, you probably aren't doing MySpace. Yeah. If you're on MySpace, you're not doing Facebook. Well, and part of it is if you think about it, you're going, well, I'm already on Facebook. What do I need MySpace for? I'm already spending that yes. much time. And that's part of it because. Just like, for example, television shows that are really popular in one spot, and then yeah. they move them to another time frame. They don't follow them. They seldom ever follow a show. It's just uh, they say, "Well, they're not loyal." Well, yeah, they're the ones that they're the ones that pound on the networks. We're talking. I I, I worked on a show called Simon and Simon, which I did. You know, I, because I did the, the you know the surf guy type of thing. You know, and, and I get in the fights and stuff, which was, I was always bigger than anybody else. So, but. Um, they moved that show around continually, and they said, well, if it had any following, it wouldn't be moved around. Yeah, the only reason it stayed on the air for like nine years was because it had enough people that were a loyal fan base that every spring they, what the hell are you people doing with our show? Mm -hmm. And so they bring it back as a, it was a replacement series for like six years. Mm -hmm. and every year, they just got tired of guys not knowing until, uh, until, uh, you know, this, until like uh, September that they were going to be picked up again. They tell people in May they're going to do it. They tell those people in September. It's the same people, I think, that are, you know, uh, uh, the same people that are involved with um, with NCIS. Mm -hmm. You know, the same, I think Chase Johnson and Donald Belisario and them. But, um, um, but it, they don't migrate. They do not migrate from one platform to the other platform. Because, uh, well, and then also sometimes, for example, I don't know about you, but if you're on Facebook, if, like, for example, somebody that um, was part one of your fans or one of your friends and they post periodically right well if so for some reason they close their account down or they change well then they lose all of those people they have and they have to start all over well we've done that yeah. a number of times we've on had, YouTube. we have been we have been jacked up to where we have um, 
four or five million views on one of the thing on one of our sites, and then because we 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 don't break the rules intentionally, we actually do our best not to. We actually do. We might push it a little bit, but we but do we our best. We will not. But it said there's nothing wrong. You know, it's just like Confucius said, "Why do the tall pine trees live so long?" Because they've learned to bend with the wind. Mm -hmm. We simply will push things, but we do not break any rules. I mean, if we flat out break no rules, but what happens is, is that um, other people, well, you know, what happens is we try not to put music in the background of anything we do that we don't write. Mm -hmm. Because what happens is, I mean, like we got hit by the person working for the Disney company that demanded the video be pulled because his music was in the background. Well, but they were paid for the music being in the background. Uh, that, it's like I had no control over because you're yeah. on a red carpet. You yeah, have no control. They're, they're playing some music in the background. And it's a, and it's a news piece. And then, the, you know, uh, Disney being Disney refuses to even respond. They mm -hmm. just yank, they want everything. Mm -hmm. It's one of these babies with the bathwater thing. They invite you to come cover something and then have you yanked because you covered it. Mm -hmm. But um, I, I come from an era, you know, like when you had, you know, Gene Autry, Hopalong Cassidy, you had John Wayne, Clark Gable, Cary Grant, um, uh, you, you know, you had Catherine Hepburn, Betty Davis. No matter where they went, the fans followed them. But what happened was sometime, I don't know when it started happening, was that the fans didn't follow you across platforms. Is, is that what, you know, like, for example, like Facebook becomes so valuable because the people stay there? It stays there. They basically, I have a tendency to believe the same people that are on Facebook, that there's a false thing about Facebook, is that if you're on Facebook, you can join other people's things, but people don't want to join Facebook. Mm -hmm. They flat out do not want to sign, I mean, we, we know people that will not join Facebook even though they need it for business purposes, they will not sign on to Facebook because yeah. of the cookies that you get stuck on you. Um, there's also, I know that there's business people that will not do Facebook because they don't want their business contacts. They don't want everybody to know who all their business contacts are. Yeah, and but it's a uh, social platform. I mean, we have four, no, I don't, fourteen thousand people over on Twitter following us, which we don't continue. I mean, we used to do that on a really solid basis. But the problem comes is the more people you have following, the less actually information you get then. Because the fact that uh, what you've got uh, 14,000 people and what you, you know, all of a sudden it's, it's, it's 500 posts down below. Well, you know, yeah, because you're getting so many feeds. That happens on Twitter. Yeah. Um, that's why some people don't follow that many, yeah. right? But, and that, there's other people that say, well, if I follow them, they'll follow me. Well, it becomes... Yeah. Well, let's just say something that you don't really pay attention to. If you want to find a subject, you look it up. Yeah. Um, or you have to remember which, which friends. The same thing happens with Facebook because because I work with a lot of people in the entertainment industry, there's a few ways of doing it. One is um, where they just open up personal accounts and they're limited to 5,000, yeah. which means you can log in, you can build your fans, you can friend somebody, they can friend you. Yeah. Um, there are options where they can see your friends and there's options where they don't see who your friends are. Yeah. But there's a, but like fan clubs though can have unlimited amounts of people. The problem is with a fan club, you can't. Um, it's, fan, it's one directional. It's one directional. You have to belong to Facebook to get into the fan club to begin with, because the fan club is not listed on. It's a non-listed thing on the internet. On the search engine. So you have to be a member of Facebook. That's why they did it that way. So basically, it's a. Once again, the fan club is almost non-migrational because if. You know, that they were following you on MySpace, they're generally not going to move over to follow you on Facebook because it means they got to fill out another form. Mm -hmm. It's just, they'll follow you on, okay, what makes YouTube work is that you don't have to join YouTube to see the videos. Uh. Yeah, over on Daily Motion, you know, which we shouldn't be saying because we know that's a bad word, but Daily Motion, you have to become a member to see a lot of the videos on Daily Motion, which mm -hmm. means is why, even though it's the only, it's the second size standing, it's second largest in the world now, uh, it basically doesn't have as many people going there because of the fact it is a migrational problem. You don't want to sign up. You don't. You, you, you basically don't want to be signed up everywhere because you forget your god awful passwords. I mean, we went into a thing yesterday with you, Yahoo. Basically, we had to go back and check on all kinds of stuff because Yahoo is changing the way it does business. So. Mm -hmm. But um, migration, I mean, um, but 
a million views a day, 14 million downloads a month, uh, multiple fan clubs all over the cruddy world, mm -hmm. you know, and you know, and, and the, the second, the second we got maybe we went from God knows how many to uh, we're actually we're doing pretty good, we're doing 5,000 views a day at the moment across sites, mm -hmm. but that's different than one million a day. Uh, yeah. And then it's, it's the same thing. The people that pay attention to me don't pay attention to me anywhere else. Mm -hmm. They pay attention to Old Cam. They do not follow me anywhere. Uh, the people that pay attention to other spring shit don't pay any attention to the bikinis are. Same person. It's really kind of odd. It's the very same person. Bikinis are is a joke. The people who watch the bikinis are don't watch Not a Spring Chick. Same swimsuit, same everything. Well, part of it is when we do something for the bikinis are, it's bikinis are specific for the audience. Yeah, but it's just all made up. It's just uh, like I said, just we did a bikinis are in this very. We did uh, the way it worked. We did uh, we we did a piece. We were doing things at the Cannes Film Festival. Then while we're getting ready, because we had to take the stuff down we were using for the Cannes Film Festival, the bikinis are was done while we're. You know, everything is being moved, everything is being changed because she gets, we, we, we talk while well, she's wearing swimming, she gets cold. No, she literally gets, she gets wound up and when she's wound up, if you let her get unwound, she becomes sort of like me. I don't want to work anymore when I come down. So, you know, that's why you only see me, and we see like these on camera all the time. No, I'm not. We're spread out over seven different sites. I'm not on camera all the time. You know, we have long pieces, but the majority of the pieces that we do, I have nothing to do with whatsoever. Mm -hmm. That's a, a total different part of the... I mean, like, I got, um, what is it, I think, you know, I, I did the 3D work on 17 different videos last night. Wow. And I'm not on one of them. None wow. of them. None of them. And there's, there's that many more a day that get done that I'm not involved with. I'm, I'm like this. You see me a lot, but I'm not here a lot. I might, you know, I'm, all, I'm I'm standing behind the camera when she's doing bikinis or something, but that's it. I'm on the bikinis or stuff talking, and I'm on, this, you know, I'm on editorials, and I'm old cam. Other than that, I'm not there. Mm -hmm. Nothing. I'm not around. But the people that see me on old cam do not migrate. And I've got a quite awful big following all over the place. You would not believe how many people out of this country watch me. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm like in 160 some different languages. They, you know, but, uh, and then the same thing with her. I mean, they'll, they'll sit there, I love this. Well, I didn't realize you were not a spring chick. <laughs> it, okay, yeah, do the introduction for the bikinis are right now. Hello, this is not a spring chick. The bikinis are. Yeah. <laughs> and that's how every single one is done. Uh, you know, you know, and, and, when, and when she's another, she does, we've got multiple characters. When she does the other character, she still, Every time that she does it, she'll hit, this is not a spring chick. Uh -huh. And she will do some interviews when she's doing interviews on her own, depending upon where she's at. She works as either, you know, JC or not a spring chick. Mm -hmm. It depends upon what they want. I mean, we have people that want her to do interviews as the bikinis are, but every time, you know, oh, this is not a spring chick. The bikinis are. Yeah. Or this is not a spring chick, you know, or this is J, not a spring chick C. You know, that's what she also introduces herself as. But you cannot miss if you're listening, which means we wonder sometimes whether they're listening or just watching the videos. Or maybe when they queue it up, they, they kind of miss the intro. I don't they don't really. Okay. You know, what? know you say it, but it's... Okay. Uh, when, when I fill out the tags underneath, I always put not a spring chick on the tags. Everything that is done has not a spring chick. No matter what it is, if I fill the tag on it, it has not a spring chick. So, um, you know, it's, it's on the front page of the bloody website. I think it's J, I, you know, J not a spring chick C. So, mm -hmm. you can't miss the fact that it's not a spring chick because that's her pet name. That and Monty Bubbles. Monty Bubbles is, uh, is the chair dog, but Monty Bubbles is our generic pet name. We're getting ready to start. Um, hopefully, we're going to be connected with a national publication within the next two weeks. So, I know. <laughs> yeah, we're waiting on that one too, which we're going to be seeing a lot, a lot of the, a lot of the writing in the footage. We we have fifty, sixty thousand pictures that we've never shown people. Mm -hmm. That we'll probably we take. Um, I think we took 
one day at the Long Beach Grand Prix, we've shot, I know I shot over 3,000 pictures one day. Mm -hmm. And she was shooting all the time with her cameras, so, plus the fact we have multiple cameras that we were using, so we have a lot of stuff that people that haven't seen it, which we're probably going to start putting up as soon as we get the affiliation. But mm -hmm. we also, the, okay, the people that are watching this don't watch CNN. Oh, that's true. Because we do CNN, I report also. Mm -hmm. We, uh, the people that do this aren't paying attention to her uh, stuff that she puts up over on um, Yahoo. Mm -hmm. See, this is how it all works. Most of them don't know no migration. It's the same, you know, like I said, you got a fan for, yeah, okay, we, we, we post across, right now it's 11 different organizations we post through. There's no following back and forth. It's all on the internet with the same names. Just if you look at the places that we're on, you know, there's 40 million, over 40 million links to MBN News Video. <laughs>